Hey there, in this video I'm going to show you how to use a custom domain name instead of localhost in XAMPP. Let's get started. First off, let's run Notepad as administrator because we are going to open the host file located under the Windows System32 drivers etc folder. And then we must map our custom domain to localhost to avoid any domain conflicts. You may hear that it's better to have a .local domain because it reflects the environment you're on and that's a good argument, but I found that it didn't suit me well because the browser that I'm using, instead of directly accessing the domain when I type it in the address bar, it searches it in the search engine instead. And I find it pretty annoying, so that's why I'm sticking to a .com domain. But you may choose whatever domain you'd like, it doesn't really matter. Now, let's save the file. The next step is to tell XAMPP about our custom domain. Open up the httpd-vhosts.conf file under the XAMPP Apache conf extra folder and down here add the following chunk of code. As you may have noticed, here is a server name which in my case is localvaron.com and because I am using a Laravel project and the entry point of the project is the public folder, that's why it is specified here as the document root. There are many customizations you can do right here. For example, you can add a port uh, if you want to access the domain like that. Um, or you can add a certificate to have encryption. But um, I think these are topics for another video. So let's keep it short and sweet. Now, all you have to do is restart the Apache and then navigate to the domain. And as you can see, it works. All right, that was it. If you like this video, stick around this channel because I will post more free stuff like this one. You can also find me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, where I also share web development and other geeky stuff. I was Carol, and I'll see you in the next one.